Checking in to update everyone on how things are going. Uh, got a new release uh, kind of right around the corner. Uh, got a new manuscript completed and am knee deep in a new writing project, of course. And, uh, you know, they've been a very active 2017 so far. But first of all, um, this is coming out May 23rd. And this is, of course, Thunder Horizon, the new Raiden Valkyrie novel and second in the Dark Sun Dawn trilogy. And we have actual pre-orders up right now, uh, both for the Kindle edition and also for signed paperback copies, and there is a bundle option if you don't have Heart of a Lion yet, and so those are open right now, and uh, yeah, make sure that you know the signed paperback copies get there by May 23rd, so order soon, and uh, also with the Kindle edition, it will be delivered right to your device the moment it is released, uh, but this is definitely gritty. Dark Edge Sword and Sorcery, and uh, I think uh, readers of, of, of novelists such as Robert E. Howard uh, will really like the, the world of Raiden Valkyrie if you haven't uh, gotten a sample it yet. Um, so yeah, get ready, because uh, she's actually being featured in, our, in a TV pilot project that uh, I'm doing this summer as a director. And so, yeah, you're going to be hearing a lot about Raiden in, in the very near future. And uh, with far as things go with uh, what's coming up in the, in the future, I've actually completed a new, uh, my first YA novel. This is the manuscript right here for it. It's uh, tentatively called uh, Dream of the Navigator, the first book in the Far Away Saga. And uh, it kind of, I describe it as... Uh, Brave New World in 1984 meets Chronicles of Narnia. Dystopian science fiction elements blended with uh, supernatural, fantastical ones, and it's got a nice balance between those two. Explores a lot of very relevant issues, uh, things I think affect everybody in this world today, uh, though the story setting is in the future. So uh, those are a few hints about what's coming with that, and it's got a, a, a four teenage characters that you follow throughout the course of the story. So it's going to be a lot of fun uh, to move into the YA world a bit. And uh, of course, that doesn't mean I'm not uh, continuing on a full throttle with my other series. And as a matter of fact, I am deep into the fourth Fires in Eden novel. And it's going to be an epic fantasy uh, novel that flows and moves as fast as a sword and sorcery novel. And I'm really excited about that one. And uh, I'm going to be, obviously, in June when I'm doing the Raiden uh, Valkyrie TV pilot, I'll probably have to uh, take a, a brief couple-week hiatus uh, from, my, from writing. Uh, but up until then and right after then, I'll be full throttle on that one and hope to complete that manuscript uh, by the fall. Uh, so it's a lot of fun. Uh, yeah, sword and sorcery, epic fantasy, and uh, YA dystopian paranormal cross-genre mix. So there's quite a lot going on on the writing end with me and I uh, definitely wanted to just update readers uh, about where I'm at and what I'm doing and what's coming up and uh, looking forward to uh, yeah a very active uh, summer so thanks again and I'll be checking in soon bye bye